Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Muhammad Isha bin Nordin and my matrix number is A176616. Introduction. Azeta Gubehat is a leading multinational company that focuses on telecommunication service in Asia and it also established in 1992. Now, Azeta has become one of the largest wireless carriers in the country. Azeta also has implemented the 4P sustainability to show that they are committed with the United Nations Global Compact UNGC in supporting their sustainable development goals. As one of the leading regional communication groups, the 4P that defines Azeta goals consists of performance, pupil, partnership, planet and also society. Azeta has spread their businesses in countries such as Pakistan, Indonesia, Thailand, Cambodia, Laos, Nepal, Sri Lanka, Myanmar, Bangladesh and also Philippines. My name is Ina Azlina binti Yusuf. My metric number is A174907. Okay. Culture of integrity and performance of company. Kitu okay. information until now, Azata had 38 nationalities employed across the group. And as we know, different nationalities come together with different cultures. Culture can be recognized through customs, ideas, social behavior of the social group. Azata take advantage of their incorporation integrity and exhibition performance which can be evaluated. Their core value that can underscore their strong foundation in ethic, ethical principle, principle and actions. All right. Next, uh, Asiata uh, to adapt with a uh, multi multi cultures improvement. Without Asiata conduct a code with certain respect and consideration among all employees, regardless of gender, age, ethnic, language culture and others all right okay and uh, next okay, to make sure to make sure the effective use of employee azata must safeguard the interest of their employee azata hold their promise by providing a safe and engagement workplace they are commitment to build a healthy work environment that safeguard their employee, work life integration, physical and mental health and safety. That's all. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Norshay Damit Ahmad Jamil. My metric number is A175866. Today, I want to talk about Azata Sustainable Development Goal, which is improving environment and social outcome. Environment is one of the most important factors that need to be considered to maintain sustainability of the company. Realizing this, Azata tried to reduce its environment footprints and contribute towards sustainable development goals. Based on Azata Annual Report 2019, Azeta tried to minimize its carbon footprint through a carbon reduction strategy. To make this strategy succeed, Azeta had focused on building a green structure and improving energy efficiency. For example, the company had 15 towers built using bamboo that have 70% reduction in carbon emission per site. They also conduct planting program in six of its market. Besides that, Azeta had done a good job by switching to renewables. They use solar power, hybrid solar system, and wind turbine as their energy resource. Azeta also focused on good health and well-being. In the COVID-19 crisis, they channel financially and give donation to support the needs of medical frontliner and affected group. The company also concerned about the quality of education. That's why Azeta developed many programs to support the education needs of the citizens in their rural area. One of the programs is Smart EDU Scholarship that supports 67 Cambodians. 
with university scholarship. The company also helped in connecting to basic utilities. For instance, Isata provide clean water and sanitation through a water tube well with reverse osmosis project in five regions in Myanmar. Hi, Assalamualaikum. My name is Nur Ainul Yakin binti Muhammad Rizwan and my metric number is A176634. Now, I will talk about strength and weakness. Basically, sustainable development goals that Asia the group Berhad to is one of the strategies to develop their business. Sustainability is the one opportunity to create a competitive advantage for a firm. All the SDG practice by Azeta have indeed had many positive effects on their own firm, customer, employees, and community. This was very clearly seen when Azeta launched 150 million cash funds for boost tabung COVID-19 to support the need of medical frontliners like personal protective equipment, PPE. This can help them all in facing this pandemic situation and ease their burden also. This action that Aziato took was in line with the goal of good health and well-being. Besides that, Aziato have used virtual meetings platform to facilitate workflow and the utilization of internal social media channels to foster continuous open communication with their employees during this pandemic COVID-19. Not only that, Azeta also kept on enforcing the strictest standard of health and hygiene to protect their employees. This shows that Azeta was very concerned about their performance and wants their employees to work comfortably without any problems. Overall, the SDGs implemented by Azeta company are very good and give a positive impact on all, include the environment. Even in COVID-19 situation, Azeta teams were still able to work well for the success of the SDG. However, there are some weakness or problem matters that Azeta has to face in empowering the SDG before and during the COVID-19 pandemic. So, for the weakness as well, aligned with Azeta efforts to minimize their carbon footprint, there are some important sustainability issues that Azeta need to prioritize in the coming years. In this context, we can see that a high investment is essential in developing and empowering this because Azeta added to build a tower using bamboo, use of solar power and hybrid solar system as energy resources. Meanwhile, at the time of COVID-19 pandemic, the job planning was disrupted due to this situation. This is because of the Movement Control Order MCO that Malaysian government doing and also restriction by governments around the world. This situation is seen as less positive for firms in implementing the SDGs as planned by Aziata. My name is Rita. My metric number is A177025. Suggestion for Axiata Group First, short, medium and long term objectivities. Axiata should examine which are the concrete activities ensuring longer term objective and more inclusive vision on the totality of the sustainable development efforts. Activities should be cleverly coordinated with each other and maintain integrated perspective so that the activities are synergized and strengthened between each. Second, context speciality. Every context should require differentiated ways of approaches, problem and solution as that would directly influence the ability to succeed in implementation. Third, collaboration with those countries that have less advanced techniques of digital. By this engagement of third-party monitoring methods increases in awareness and involvement and enlarge the pool of data points to source from. Fourth, invest in attracting and retaining top digital talents. The value of digital trust will become a business proposition as they transform into a digital champion. They need to be able to demonstrate to regulators and customers that they are not only have the processes established, but also an organization-wide culture that respects and protects customer rights, privacy, and their data. Climate Resilience Axiata must demonstrate through governance, 
policies and programs that they are building a business that is resilient to the impacts of climate change and provides meaningful services that promote digital inclusion. Thank you. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I'm Izzatul Marni binti Abdul Aziz, metric number A174759. I will now conclude our group report of Azeta Company. In summary, Azeta has been maintaining their sustainability in order to be the next generation digital champion. They have been displaying honesty and fairness in their business. Also, realizing that Employees are one of the reasons to the company's growth and success. They always respect their workers of every level. Azeta is taking care of the environment by minimizing its carbon footprint through a carbon reduction, which also improves their energy efficiency. It shows that Azeta managed to maintain their sustainability and will continue being the top company among the telecommunication services company in Asia. That's all from our group. Thank you.